ChemBlox models demonstrate CO2 vibration modes and methane combustion. Here is carbon dioxide with just the molecular bonding electrons. A pair of the CO2 bonds are in the pi bond orientation. The electrons on the carbon are in their spin-up oxidized orientation. Carbon dioxide can absorb certain frequencies of electromagnetic energy that can change the energy levels of the bonds causing the molecule to vibrate. This is not the whole picture of the vibration because electrons follow a quantum principle that allows the spin of the electron to be in both its spin up and spin down state simultaneously. During the vibration shown, the CO2 paired spin molecular bond electrons are in simultaneous spin states that are different than the vibration. Here, the carbon is in the reduced state with spin down electrons on it. And this simultaneous state with the carbon having the oxidized electrons spin up state on it. Notice that even in the simultaneous states that the electrons still need to follow the Pauli exclusion principle of one spin up and one spin down in an orbital. These simultaneous spin states allow the vibration to propagate back and forth, slowly seeding its energy. Now showing a photon emission using a hydrogen atom in its spin down ground state. The electron is knocked out of its orbital into the 2s orbital with its spin in the plus one half state for the allowed energy transition state when it goes back down to its ground state and emits a photon at exactly half the energy for the cycle as Einstein's photoelectric effect dictates. A photon like this can be absorbed by CO2 as described and splits the photon's energy into two half spin transitions in the bonds causing vibration. Two oxygens react with one methane molecule. The unpaired electron on the oxygen is drawn to the electropositive hydrogen. Shown here is the carbon-hydrogen bond in its quantum simultaneous state of the reduced hydrogen and the oxidized carbon electron. The hydrogen sees the spin-up electron on the oxygen, and since oxygen's electronegativity is higher than carbon's electronegativity, the oxygen spin-up electron is in a lower energy state and queen takes pawn. The unpaired electron on the oxygen forms a peroxide with the carbon. A hydroxyl radical splits from the oxygen and takes another hydrogen to form a water molecule. The oxygen on the carbon forms a second bond. The same steps occur on the other oxygen. The peroxide forms, then the hydroxyl radical splits from the oxygen and forms a second water molecule. And then the oxygen finishes producing the carbon dioxide. Completing the combustion of methane.